What is up guys? Welcome back to another video. In today's video, we're gonna be wrapping this Colorado. We got the print here. It's printed by a different wrap shop. This is the design that we're doing. We're actually doing a total of eight trucks for these guys. So we're gonna start with this one. This is the first one out of eight. It is printed on 3M. Not a huge fan, but I've worked with it before, so I kind of have an idea of how it works compared to like SLX Plus and stuff like that. Then go ahead and prep it, take off a few plastics like this stuff right here. Take that off, take tail lights out, sticker off. The box is getting full wrap and then it kind of swooshes down like that. I do need to figure out measurements to see if I have to take off that Colorado there. Uh, that plastic will come off, that plastic, a little mud flap. We have this side's pretty much done. Like I did all the trimming and tucking here. I just need to trim there and trim the wheel. Other than that, the back side's done. Now it's just this here. Slight pressure, not much pressure on this guy right here. Got tacked on the meter. Got my magnets. Actually, got part of the back people back there. Reach under here. Just this 
Pretty much nicely glossed. So we got a little bit here, but I have to do a bunch of pulling down there anyway. A little there. That's gonna come up once I start squeezing in there. You guys can see. So that's how I do a box side. Gloss it out, or I get it leveled out to where I want, positioned where I want, tack down the one side or pull the backing down, tack it on the one side, start pulling, tack down the bottom, and then you can pull the rest of the backing off and make sure you're still good on this side, which that's what you saw me do. I kind of glassed it out around this corner. I know I still have these wrinkles to take out, care of, but that's easy. And I got it to where I want it. So I'm just like this other side here. So now we're good. We're gonna start a nice squeegee from about here up and then there down and then go that way and that way. we go, box side number two done. That. Looks a little more red in the camera. Yeah, got that mocked up now. Gonna start installing that. down more. I already got that kind of tacked down to that area. This is all just glassed. Can start squeegeeing. All right, so I got the tailgate done with the letters. So from the top down to the bottom of the letters. Just got the E and T here yet. I thought I would film that just to show you guys how I do that with just a wrap glove going into the actual like letters, putting it in there without having issues. The rest of the wrap is done. Once I'm done this, it's just decals on the back here, a couple decals on the doors there, and then we're good to go. Just pull on the bottom here, just so I get tension. A little bit of heat, not too much. And then just firm pressure. I'm just going on the one side, firm pressure with my thumb or finger. And then work that way. Really make it sure I get it pushed really good into those corners.
just like that. So just that T yet. I'm trying to, I'm gonna leave, you can tell I did, pushed it everywhere around. This is not squeegee down or back glove down, I guess you could say. <laughs> but you got this big chunk of the T. So that'd be a lot of air if I pushed down here and then just tried to make the air disappear with the air aggress air release in the film. I'm so leaving this corner open and I'm gonna push down towards that point. Give it a little bit of heat yet again. Start at the top here. Push down. Middle. And push down right to that corner. There we go. No air left behind. No bubbles or wrinkles. At this point, I kind of try to get it all to the same height, and then I can start using the squeegee again. And go on to it. We got it done. Less than a day's worth of work. Got the wrap, tackles. Tackles on here, the tailgate is wrapped too. Yeah, there we go. This is one out of eight. We're doing a total of eight trucks for this company. Two Colorados, I think three Sierras and three uh, Silverados. So stay tuned, maybe I'll do another one of those bigger ones. Four of them are full wraps, three or four of them are kind of partial wraps like this here. So yeah, here we go. We could wrap all the way in here. This is actually way more orange, like I've said multiple times, in real than it is. It's gonna be a weird, really weird color on camera. Got it wrapped. Wrap, 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 yeah. I wrap all the way in and along there. Yeah, there we go. If you guys enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up. Comment your thoughts down below. This was not designed by us, was not printed by us, just installed by us. Um, it's all corporate stuff, so. Corporate designs it, big, huge sign wrap shop or whatever, um, and I think Toronto does all the printing for this, these guys. So they just print it, cut it, laminate, or print, laminate, cut, and then ship it out to us, and then we install it. So make sure you guys, you know, hit that subscribe button, like button. See you guys in the next one. If you guys need a wrap, let us know.